Hi, we're here with Robin Benefield, who is the managing editor at Marriott International. So my role as managing editor um, is uh, overseeing uh, content production on Marriott Traveler. It is a destination uh, travel site that we started about two years ago. Right. Um, and I like to call it a digital storytelling platform. Um, it is a place where we're telling stories um, about Marriott. We're talking about the destinations where there might be a property, um, talking about those destinations through the people that live in those destinations. Um, and that comes on right down to the property level. So chefs and bartenders uh, in that space. and talking about them as experts um, on those destinations um, and kind of shining a light um, not just on the property but the people who are there. What you've done is you've become very authentic in the manner in which you're creating content. It's your actual employees that work in the hotel mm -hmm. telling the stories. And so I would call those you know, very micro-influencers. Mm -hmm. And the challenge with micro-influencers, a lot of people will say there's, there's, there's very little scale. Mm -hmm. uh, so how are people, consumers actually seeing this content? Yeah, they're seeing it you know, primarily through our site um, uh, through mobile, right? Mm -hmm. um, about 60% of our traffic is through mobile. Okay. So a lot of our, our brands and uh, Marriott Rewards, mm -hmm. um, they're sharing those stories through social mm -hmm. um, and people are coming to them that way. We do um, some paid media, mm -hmm. so um, people are finding the stories that way. Um, we're working with brand partners. Um, we work with Jet Setter. Um, they're a, a similar uh, site that talks about destinations, so they're showcasing our content on their site. What would you say to brands that are struggling to get in the content marketing game? Because I think what you're doing is you're taking a longer term view. Now the challenge with that is there might not be immediate conversion right away, mm -hmm. right? And I think that's what's stopping other people from doing what you're doing. Yeah. What advice would you give to them? There is a long game, but I think there are some definite wins early on. I mean, what we've been able to do with these articles is you know, um, at the end of each article, we are posting where to stay, okay. right? Um, so we're posting links to all of the properties that would be in that destination or, you know, a good handful of them. And we're seeing conversion. People mm -hmm. at some point, maybe they're not going to that specific destination mm -hmm. or that specific property that they see, but they're coming back and they're coming back and they're clicking on those links. Um, and booking. So are you working with mid-tier and celebrity influencers? We define them, the mid-tier as having hundreds of thousands of followers, let's say, and the celebrities as having, you know, let's say over a million. Uh, are you somehow having them create content for you too? We've worked with influencers in conjunction with brands or mm. partners. If someone is working with an influencer, we try to figure out, well, what's the traveler angle? Um, what is a piece of content that we could get from that influencer that continues to tell the story in a more evergreen way, mm -hmm. so that lasts on the site, and also then the brand gets a chance to to further amplify the message that they they want to share. So you've made a lot of headway in two years. Last question, where are you going to be in three years? Yeah. We are working very closely with brands um, and other teams in terms of helping them develop content, right? So we really want to create a network of sites. Um, we're thinking about ourselves like, you know, the next uh, Condé Nast, right? Uh, right? Um, so that, you know, W has its own content site. Mm -hmm. So what role do we play and how are we um, sharing their content in terms of the network. They have their own space and, and how they talk about content in a still very authentic way and Traveler has its way and we're all kind of cross-promoting one another and really building this kind of um, network of, 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 of storytelling platforms. So I look forward to seeing that in 2020. Absolutely. Thanks Robin. Thank you Appreciate so much. Appreciate it.